Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Shelby. I just got back from Bath and Body Works. Um, I did an exchange. Um, so I guess this would be like an exchange haul. Um, yeah, I did. I exchanged four candles. So I took back winter. Um, I just didn't really like the fragrance. Um, I do still have one winter three wick candle. Um, because maybe around like winter time I will vibe with it more but I'm just not right now I haven't returned an almond blossom um I thought that the smell would be more of like that pure almond um that they had last I believe it was last winter um it was just almond and I think maybe a little bit of vanilla but it just smelled like pure almond like almond cookies <laughs> it was phenomenal this one had some musky note grossness to it that I did not like. Next was the Blueberry Lavender Spritzer. I thought I was going to enjoy it more. A lot of people said that they loved it. Um, I did not like it on cold. I tried it, I tried to smell it a few different times and I thought I would like it, but I just didn't. And then the last one was the White Lavender Eucalyptus. The jar was pretty. That's pretty much why I bought it. Um, I ordered it online and I was like, the jar is really pretty. Hopefully I like it. I smelt it. Was not a huge fan. So um, I did not burn any of those because generally if I get a candle and don't like the fragrance on cold, there's a good chance that I'm not going to like it once it's burnt. Um, and so I really only ever exchange candles if it is... Um, like candles that I got home and I didn't really enjoy the fragrance or candles that I purchased online and ended up not liking the fragrance once they came. Um, that's really the only time that I do exchanges. I know some people will like burn the candle halfway through and then do exchange. Um, so then they never have to buy a new candle, which is ridiculous. That's why prices are going up. Um, but yeah, I always... 95% of the time if I'm going to exchange it is before I've even burned the candle um and so if that's the case they can put it back on the sales floor I believe um but occasionally not often I will exchange them out after my first initial burn because I'm like uh there's no fragrance really it's there's no fragrance to it or the candle smelled a little off um, when it was burning. So those are like the only two times that I will exchange once I've burnt and it's only after the first burn. So don't be like those people that exchange after halfway through every single time because that's so annoying. That's why we're paying a lot more for candles and everything else than what we were. So that's my little tangent. Um, <clears throat> so I guess let's get started with what I exchanged for. Um, first is Dark Blue Night. Look at this jar. It is so pretty. Um, it is crisp mountain air, fresh lavender, and a touch of musk with natural essential oils. This is Bath and Body Works, um, not White Barn. And it's just got the, like, white creamy wax. Um, I really, really like this fragrance. The crisp mountain air, you get it. <laughs> It is crisp mountain air, and there's just like a slight little bit of lavender, um, which I like that more. I like the slight little bit of lavender, not like super strong, um, and then just a touch of musk. Um, also, the candles have went up to twenty five fifty, which is a huge bummer. Um, but that's what happens when people don't follow the rules properly. But I, I don't know. I'll stop on that. Um, sweater weather, one of my all-time favorites. This is fresh sage, juniper berries, aromatic eucalyptus with fresh woods. This jar is stunning. Like that sticker is so pretty. Um, oh, I love sweater weather. This is a perfect fall or winter smell. I love sweater weather so stinking much, but yeah, I wish it was a all-around label because I prefer them when they wrap all the way around. But this is just a really pretty sticker either way. <clears throat> Next, I got Autumn Adventure. Um, and this is 
bright citrus, warm cedar wood, fresh mint with natural essential oils. And again, just like your straight up white wax. You definitely, I mean, you do, I think the mint will stand out more when it's burning, um, but you definitely get the warm cedar wood and the citrus. But I think the mint, like there's a subtle mint to it. Yeah, I think you'll get that more when it's burning, which I'm excited about. And then my last one is Honey Wildflower. So I am filming this at the very start of August. Um, I am not sure when this is getting posted, but this is a newer fragrance. Um, this finally, finally got to my store. Um, it was taking forever to get to my store. Um, but this is what it looks like. Honey Wildflower. Um, it is crisp pear, fresh wildflowers, and sweet honey with natural essential oils. Um, this one says it's $24.50, whereas the other three were $25.50. So I don't know what the difference is um, with all of that, but the jar is so cute. So cute. And it smells so good. Um, the wildflowers is very strong. And you get the, like, the back note is that sweet honey um, pear. You get pear in there. But I think the wildflowers is, like, the top strong note. And maybe pear is, like, the middler note. And the honey is, like, the back note. If that makes sense. I don't know. <laughs> Honestly, I am not a fragrance queen. So I don't fully know what I'm talking about. <laughs> but... Then I got two free items uh, with different free coupons, um, a free hand cream, which is champagne, apple, and honey. I love champagne, apple, and honey, and that's why I also got it in a wallflower refill. Um, the notes are pink lady apple, sparkling champagne, and jasmine honey. I love this. I have multiple candles in this fragrance. Um, I have body care in this fragrance. I love champagne apples and honey it's so so good um yeah so I'm glad that I got both of these for free um because they're both regularly $7.50 so I believe that would be $15 for free so um <clears throat> I love being on the coupon um coupon list I somehow I get them every month. I know some people get them once a year, once every three months, but I don't know why, but I get it every month, which I am so grateful for, um, because I love, love the free stuff. So yeah, <laughs> that is my return haul, exchange haul. Um, yeah, let me know if you have tried out any of these and what your thoughts were. Um, and what your thoughts are on Bath and Body Works exchange policy because I hear that it's changing. Um, but I feel like they've been saying that for like a year now and it hasn't yet. So just let me know down below. Um, I will see you guys soon. Peace.